In this AutoCAD tutorial, I want to cover how you use the trim uh, option in terms of editing surfaces. So all I have is a very simple surface in my northwest isometric view. On the left of my screen you can see the profile here, so it's nothing special. Uh, but it's a, it's a good example to show how you can cut something out. So what I'm going to do is actually just draw something on this back surface. Uh, to do that, the first thing I'm really going to want to do is change my UCS to be in line with that. So I'm going to type in UCS, enter, and then I'm going to do F for face, and I'm just going to select the face of this surface and enter to accept it. So now when I draw, I'll be in line with this surface. I'm just going to do a simple circle, so C, enter for circle, and I'm just uh, going to use my object snap tracking to line up with that midpoint, come down, and I'll just you know make some circle on that surface. To make it an actual surface itself, I'll just use an extrude, select it, and I'll go back into space. Okay, so if I change that maybe to um, conceptual, you'll be able to see that it's still uh, closed right there. So if I wanted to open that circle up, all I have to do is come up to trim. I'm going to select the surface that I want to trim, so that'll be this one right here. Enter. Select the cutting curve, so I'll choose that circle. Enter and then I'll just select the part I want to get rid of. So now I've basically cut a hole out for that tube. So if I just rotate that around a little bit, there we go. So that's just using the surface trim option to cut out a hole. If you decide at some point that you don't want that hole cut out anymore, it's actually very simple to reverse the trim process. All you have to do is go back up to that edit panel and choose untrim, select the surface, and it will fill it in. It's just that easy.